I welcome all of you on your PDA platform and my this video is related to the interview document of Power Grid Corporation of India Limited PGCIL. As you know the GD and interview for PGCIL have already been declared and uh, in the interview HR part is very very important. In the HR part they ask you questions related to the organization in this case PGCIL. You know they tend to ask you some question uh, which are related to this particular organization and uh, what is the administrative structure of this organization, what are various business verticals of this uh, organization, what are various clients and what are various products and when was it established, where are its headquarters and where are its various offices and what are the current news related to PGCIL. So those all questions you should be aware and you should know the organization for which you are going uh, to take the interview. So uh, what I advise is like this document must be available on the website of your PDA. You can go on the website of your PDA and download this document. But at the same time uh, after going through this document you should also go through the website of PGCIL because sometime they ask you question which are related to website. They ask you that whether you have seen our website or not and in that case you should say that yes sir out of curiosity because I was going for the interview of PGCIL so out of curiosity I have seen the website and this is something which I saw in that website and this is something which I liked in the website and all. So you should be aware about that. Though we have put all the current things into this the board of directors we have seen and uh, various uh, office bearer new office bearer we have updated but still I advise you to go through the website. Now I will not be going through in detail of this you take this document and read it but I tell you how to go through this particular document. First of all you should be knowing that when was this organization created, where is the headquarter of uh, power grid corporation that is in Gurgaon and uh, you know sometime who is the CMD and all those things are mentioned and what are the various uh, 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 products of this organization like it is into transmission, distribution, energy trading, uh, we will be discussing another verticals also and which ministry is this organization, this Maharatana company comes under which ministry, those things should be known to you. And uh, it is a statutory corporation means it was created under law and it is under ministry of power and headquarter as I told you is this and uh, about 50 percent power grid transmits about 50 percent of to total power generated in India. So transmission ke liye it is a major uh, body in the transmission you know and then certain things like ISO certification and all you should be aware uh, they are provided. Vision and mission is something which is important because they tend to ask you these things in the question. Uh, in the interview that uh, are you aware about our vision, are you aware about our mission, what are our vision, what are our mission. So I advise you don't wrote memorize but at least go through what are the various visions and missions. Now power grid uh, certain information like uh, what is power grid it is a Maharatana company and you should know what is Maharatana status actually which we have provided in the document when was it incorporated under companies act 1956 and 51 uh, percent of the you know shareholding is of government of India that is what the public sectors are more than 50 percent are of government and uh, the rest are with the private players or maybe public sectors and there are institutional investors or public when you take the shares of these companies. It is the largest electric power transmission utility and uh, it is a company listed company and uh, you know it has it is Maharatana status now largest electric power transmission as I told you and excellent award uh, are given to it uh, in particular you know domains, uh, many domains, many uh, dimensions. Uh, one of that is corporate social responsibility. So CSR practices may continuously wo achha performance hai power grid corporation ka. Uh, just to go through these all details which are mentioned, uh, they may ask you uh, these details and abhi uh, kya kya iske verticals hain that is also mentioned. Transmission hai, consultancy hai, telecom hai, ye humare alag alag verticals hai, jo power grid ke hai. It is into transmission, it is into consultancy, uh, alag alag clients hai, alag alag countries mein iske clients hai. Or telecom ke andar also it is trying to enter into telecom also. Like Gale, Gas Authority of India Limited, Power Grid Corporation of India also, because of the transmission, uh, telecom also becomes one of the options. So, uh, this is entering into telecom domain also. A power grid is not telecom mein hai ki nahi, that uh, becomes one of the questions. And that detail is how many kilometers of transmission is, how many substations are, uh, 
एंड कंसल्टेंसी में कितने क्लाइंट्स हैं कितनी कंट्रीज में कंसल्टेंसी विच एरिया इट प्रोवाइड द कंसल्टेंसी एंड टेलीकॉम में हाउ मेनी लोकेशन आर देयर एंड टेलीकॉम नेटवर्क हाउ वट काइंड ऑफ नेटवर्क इज देयर सो दीज आर द्री बिजनेस वर्टिकल्स इफ दे आस्क यू इन द इंटरव्यू दैट वेदर कैन यू टेल दैट पावर ग्रेड कॉर्पोरेशन ऑफ इंडिया लिमिटेड इज इन टू विच डिफरेंट बिजनेस मॉडल्स बिजनेस डोमेन सो यू शुड से दीज आर इन टू दीज बिजनेस डोमेन्स now uh, you know this is uh, power grid is uh, diversification uh, is uh, also trying to diversify into other domains ye aapka jo transmission mein it was already there but it is trying to diversify into other domains also <coughs> yeah so it is trying to diversify into now telecom uh, domain also it is trying to create uh, niche for itself in now telecom business using existing transmission asset so if they ask you in the interview that uh, why power grid is entering into telecom it is uh, a transmission distribution company so why into telecom you say sir telecom business because we have existing transmission lines and we want to use it uh, energy investment in energy efficiency smart grid so these are the terms which are asked in the interview do you know what is smart meter what is smart grid one grid one nation one frequency what is the meaning of that so those kind of questions are normally asked to you so go through this uh, information which are provided so as i was telling you te transmission telecom and consultancy ye teen iske business verticals hain which you should be aware so transmission mein these are the things uh, green energy corridors uh, you should know what is the meaning of that so whenever you come across some term you should be you know very good in those terms like uh, renewable energy integration what do you understand by that green energy corridors what do you understand by green energy uh, corridors uh, transmission ultra mega solar power parks what do you mean by ultra mega solar power parks are you aware about these things or not so the moment you google it out jo bhi aapke paas yahan terms aa rahi hain unko google out karoge aap you will start finding and then isi notes ke upar take the print out of this and in this particular thing only start writing it so if you want to prepare very nicely for the interview of power grid take the hard copy of these notes and keep adding those things in the uh, you know these uh, hard copies only like uh, green energy corridor now what is green energy corridor you google it out and you will get some information jot it down there only so this document will become a really good document for you to prepare for the interview yeah now what is high capacity transmission corridor and uh, uh, what are the international links with neighboring countries so telecom mein the business brand is power tel so इंटरव्यू में दे कैन आस्क यू वट इज द यू नो बिजनेस वट इज द ब्रांड नेम ऑफ टेलीकॉम बिजनेस विच पावर ग्रेड इज गोइंग टू एंटर इन टू सो यू शुड बी अवेयर अबाउट दैट सो वट इज एन एल डी नेशनल लॉन्ग डिस्टेंस और वट इज डी एल सी दिस टर्मिनोलॉजी यू शुड बी अवेयर नो एज फार एज द कंसल्टेंसी इज कंसर्न ट्रांसमिशन डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन एंड टेलीकॉम एज ए टोल्ड यू आर द थ्री मेन बिजनेस वर्टिकल्स सो वट आर द वेरियस कंसल्टेंसीज इन टू विच इट इज एंटरिंग and as i told you like you know implementation of the smart grid projects energy efficiency energy auditing capacity building these are the different consultancy projects in which it is entering uh, solar power generation rooftop solar system energy audit energy efficiency uh, integration of solar power projects smart grid smart metering so these names are business verticals other than these three these are the other business verticals so in the interview he is going to ask you question directly from each one of these like what do you understand by you know smart grid what do you understand by smart meter what do you mean by uh, you know rooftop solar system have you heard about that so what do you mean by energy auditing so these these are the question he ask you straight i was telling you about one nation one grid one frequency it is the logo of power ministry if you go to power ministry website you will find this power minister is uh, shri r k singh is the power minister and uh, minister of state for power also you should know his name and uh, you know uh, like why you want to join power grid corporation the answer of that also comes from these kind of documents why do you want to become the part of pgcl so you can always say sir this is the maharatna company dealing with the energy sector it is a major in energy sector Uh, we have mentioned somewhere that this is a uh, biggest public sector dealing with the uh, you know energy sector and uh, it's a energy sector plays very crucial role in progress of the country and contributes to both uh, you know uh, doing business and ease of living so actually energy sector uh, plays a role in the socio economic development of the people and quality of life of people so i want to become the part of that organization 
which eventually contributes into the national growth and socio-economic development of the people of the nation. So, from there you get an idea that yes, I want to join this organization for these reasons. So, there are five regional grids you must be knowing and uh, national grid is required to connect all these grids and uh, this you know there is a capacity of uh, this much transmission capacity of this much uh, lakh megawatt that you should be aware and we want to enhance it further uh, by 2022 that is the target which we have kept for ourselves. So, this is how the grid evolved that 1991 when there were five regional grids with five frequencies and then you know we got uh, synchronization and eventually in December 2013 we got all India synchronized grid that is how the grid integration took place. Some idea about synchronization of all the grids you should be knowing and what are the benefit of that that also you should know. So, how the national grid evolution took place for the national grid. So, detail thoda sa pad lena ki kis tarikhe se humne usko evolve kiya and today we have one nation one grid one frequency. So, what is the meaning of that? Now comes who is the CMD of uh, power grid corporation Shri Shri Kant and unka background kya hai? He is basically postgraduate diploma in management, finance background se hai wo, uh, MDI Gurgaon se unhone apna gradu uh, post graduation kiya hai and the details are also mentioned about the chairman. Sometime he ask you do you know your chairman and what is his background. Other than chairman you should be knowing about director finance, uh, name should be known, director project his name should be known and director personal is someone who deals with HR and recruitment you understand. So, the people who will be uh, sitting in the interview and all they will be working under Shri Vinod Kumar Singh because that is a recruitment related domain right. So, you should be knowing about that. Now, what is the sustainable development and uh, what is the meaning of sustainable development and how power grid corporation of India which is ISO 14001 certified company and largest electric power transmission utility in the world not in India it is the largest electric power transmission utility in the world. So, uh, how it deals with the you know minimum environmental uh, impact or social impact and uh, meeting the social goal of uh, you know this sustainable development goals. You know there are 17 sustainable development goals. So, um, global warming, sustainable development goal, environmental protection you should be aware about these terminologies which are important terminologies. Okay, now, uh, so this just go through how Power Grid Corporation of India Limited talks about environment and social policy. Then what is the meaning of green installations, hybrid generation plants, where it is creating those hybrid generation plants and Goa may solar plants, kitane capacity ke power plants laga rahe. What do you mean by rain water harvesting? So, uh, these terms like you know hybrid generation plant kisko bolte hain, solar photovoltaic cells kya hote hain or wind generation kaise hota hai, kahan pe inke plants and that you should be knowing. Electric vehicle, what do you mean by electric vehicle and what is the role of power grid in electric vehicle, what is mean by smart grid, just go through that. How do we understand by smart grid? So, uh, just go through this uh, you know diagram and try to understand what is the meaning of smart grid, how it is linked to different kind of utilities and renewable energy sources. Then uh, at the end uh, you know it is uh, classification of Maharatana company, Navaratana company, Mini Ratana company is given. Maharatana company ke liye kya requirement hai, how much should be the net profit and uh, what should be you know uh, average turnover and uh, all these things should be known to you. And what are the criteria to become Maharatana company that should also be known to you. So, it should always be, it should already be Navaratana company and which are the Maharatana companies. So, power grid is the last to become Maharatana company in 2019. In fact, it is a recent company 1989 and then uh, you know it became Maharatna uh, company in I think 30 years it became the Maharatna company. So, recently PGCIL was in news for which reasons it was in news, what awards PGCIL has won, what are the different awards it has gone and uh, what work it has done in corporate social responsibility, what are the various uh, CSR activities in which Power Grid Corporation of India Limited was involved and uh, where some new substation has come up and uh, what is the new development, uh, what is the new telecom subsidiary PGCIL. So, Power Grid Tele Services a new telecom subsidiary is coming up. So, they have given that particular details uh, 5G, 4G base is to be created 
and uh, some more information current issues related to finance so first quarter mein kitna finance tha how we have developed and all so especially from finance background people this information is very very important so power grid corporation is looking to increase the investment in energy storage projects and 5 megawatt rooftop solar uh, across 50 of its premises that detail is also mentioned just to go through all these were in the news recently telecom business is to be separated and uh, it is to be created as a separate you know uh, business vertical for it uh, so just to go through all these information which are provided to you which are related to the recent updates of this particular body and awards kya kya awards mile hain power grid ko so all these things are mentioned sometime they ask you where is the registered office where is the head office where is the nsc national stock exchange and bombay stock exchange mein share रेट शेयर मार्केट में इनका कितना शेयर का कॉस्ट कितना चल रहा है दोज थिंग्स आर ऑल्सो आस्ट सो आई मस्ट से दैट दिस डॉक्यूमेंट यू टेक दिस डॉक्यूमेंट यू टेक द प्रिंट आउट ऑफ दिस डॉक्यूमेंट एंड देन गो टू द वेबसाइट एंड कीप जोटिंग ऑन द थिंग्स वट एवर टर्म यू गेट ऑन दिस पर्टिकुलर डॉक्यूमेंट लाइक सपोज यू गेट स्मार्ट ग्रिड एंड यू डोंट नो स्मार्ट ग्रिड तो वहाँ से इंटरनेट पर जाओ स्मार्ट ग्रिड को देखो वट इज़ द मीनिंग ऑफ दैट एंड नोट इट डाउन ऑन दिस डॉक्यूमेंट देन यू स्टार्ट योर एच आर विद द मेंटर्स ऑफ योर पीडिया they will ask you many questions the practice will be done and through that practice you will become more confident and i am very sure the similar question they are going to ask you in the interview hope it uh, this particular document will be helpful to you so download it from the website of yourpedia and prepare well for this interview which is very good company power grid corporation of india limited thank you